What's going on guys? Linus here. Welcome back to Civilization V as Scotland. Wait a minute, Scotland, you say? That's not in the game at all. What are you talking about? Well, it's a, it's a mod. <laughs> I don't know why I'm doing this intro. I've never done that before. Anyway, uh, yeah, we're friends with Zanzibar and we will remain friends with them for a while. And we got to figure out a way to get um, Bucharest back. So we do need to get an artist uh, as soon as we can. And um, getting the National College, that'll be pretty great. And as soon as we get access to a workshop, we're going to send production over to Glasgow because it's not going that well over there. Um, all right. Keep going. All right. So our borders have grown. That's it. That is one thing that's been going quite well is the borders are growing really quickly. All right. So theology, not bad at all. Medieval era. All right, keep going. We got to figure out where these people are, man. We have the great lighthouse, so we should be able to to send out some boats. Get some nice movement and all that jazz. Oh, look at that. We might be able. Well, maybe. We'll see. I see some options. Uh, all right. So that why do you know what? I like the gold, but I like the production a whole lot more. So we're going with that. It's not the best tile by any means. But, you know, you gotta take what you get. I mean, you don't really have a choice if you think about it, so... Alright, the pyramids have been built. Oh, that is bad. Alright. Move out. Get get the hell out of there. Don't die, guys. Um, Alright, so I'm gonna send this guy out there to make farms around Edim Edinburgh. Ooh, we, we can get the cotton. Alright, we gotta do that. We have the citrus, we build a bunch of farms, you know, that's all good. But now we gotta think about our other city. Can we kill them? They're so annoying, my god. Alright, go. I just realized that it seems like there's different music in this mod. It's, it sounds a little Scottish. You guys probably can't hear. There's a lot of bagpipes going on. Which, you know, when I hear bagpipes, I'm like, yep, that's Scotland. But then again, I'm pretty sure that that doesn't really happen a whole lot anymore in Scotland, that everybody's playing bagpipes. Maybe they are. I don't know anything about Scotland. I've never been there. Uh, let's see. All right, Watermail Circus. So, all right, the Oracle Hagia Sophia is pretty great because you get a free temple, which we do need to get, and a free great prophet and some faith. But I also kind of like the Oracle. The National Epic's pretty great, but we don't have to rush for that. The Hagia Sophia is usually very, very popular. Um, so if we do get that, that would give our religion a bit of a uh, a kickstart. Yeah. All right. Mm, I'm not really sure if I want to do this, but you know what? Let's give it a go. We're playing on King, so there is the possibility that we might get it. I mean, it's not looking very great, but it is entirely possible. All right, shoot them. Get them out of here. All right. Get that cotton. You are going to make some more farms. For the, uh, the Glas Glasgowians. Glasgowians. I haven't looked it up yet. I haven't looked it up. Glasgow, Glasgow. I don't know. It both sounds pretty feasible to me. But then again, you know, there's all these different pronunciations for all these different words and cities and... I don't know. I have no idea. I have the same problem when I played uh, Crusader Kings 2 as Ireland. And you have all these things where I have, like, no idea how to pronounce it. Uh, alright, here we go. Glasgow's gonna grow. We have a lot of happiness, and that's something I want to keep up for sure. Alright, kill the Hand X. Get them out of here. Yep, working that. That's exactly what I had in mind anyway, so we're good. Noise. And then Edinburgh keeps growing. Come on. Ooh, great profit. Alright, so we have the first one, which is awesome. Uh, Alright, kill the hand axe because they're pretty annoying. Let's get our religion going. Uh, I'm obviously going to go with Judaism. And I'm going to grab Tithe. And I want to say we do have incense. So that's pretty great. We have two incense. Alright, let's just see. Let's just see. Alright, so Tithe. 
Then again, pagodas are also pretty awesome. But if we are going to go for cultural stuff, then getting monasteries could be pretty good. And then also pagodas appear to be taken already. Then again, mosques are also pretty cool. You know what? Let's start with monasteries and then we'll get another belief, hopefully after we get Hagia Sophia. Um, so we'll go with that. So how much is a monastery anyway? Borobudur. Also pretty awesome. And Hagia Sophia gives you that instant chance to um, enhance your religion. Which is pretty awesome, let's be honest. So after we get our profit, we can actually use our faith to go... Yeah, let's take them out. We can use our faith to, um, to buy a monastery in the capital city. All right, we're the happiest people on earth. Suck on that, other people. You're not beating me. All right, cotton is done. Why would I make a farm there? No, I don't want to do that. I want to make some around the river. Yeah. Okay. Let's get one more farm over here and then I'll just leave it at that. I don't have construction quite yet. Even though I would love to grab it. The Colossus. That hasn't been made yet, has it? I don't think I've seen that before in this game. If we can make that... I'm just saying, there is a slight chance. If we do make that, that'd be pretty sweet. So... Something to think about. Uh, Alright, go over there. Alright, and then we probably want to start spreading our religion to... Uh, oh, they have, they have Catholicism. Alright, that could lead to some problems, but I do want to try and convert some of their cities. Wait, why did it... Oh, did I click this by accident? Are you kidding me? Son of a bitch. Alright, let's just... Oh, I regret doing that. And it was an accident too, so now I feel like an idiot. There you go. Alright, so never click the little city because you will regret it. Just don't do that. All right. My God. All right. Let's get a farm going there. And then Hagia Sophia. I want that. I want that so bad. Wait, do we get it? Oh, we have to wait four more turns. All right. Kill. Policy. All right. So construct stuff faster. Bunch of excess happiness added each turn to the amount of culture. That's really good for me right now because that's 13 culture a turn. I'm going with that one. Wait, it just turned into 16. I don't know why. But I'm sure as heck not turning it down. Because that is some good culture at the start of the game. It really is. Alright, let's go. Take that out. I do not want it around here. I want all the barbarians gone from my lands. They have no place here. Are you kidding me? Why is my luck always so terrible? Alright, wipe them out. City has grown. They're working that. I guess I'm fine with it now. You know what? I'm going to go ahead and buy a work boat. So we can get those pearls as well. Oh, we were buddies with Bucharest. That's where we were getting some culture. Yeah, we can give him some money. But for now, I'm going to hold off on that. Because I'm not really sure I want to do that quite yet. Uh, it is an option though. Especially since they are cultural, that would be a big help. All right, go, go, go. You go get me those pearls, son. Because that means extra food. All right, you need to heal up because you're basically useless right now. Ryder, go write me a, a Stuvern. Sweet. And then we can go ahead and put that... Wait, we have two... No, we have one piece of art and one writing. All right. Wait, do we not have an amphitheater? Oh, that is where we are putting the writing. All right. All right, we're cool. Get me that wonder, man. Don't screw me over on this one. Don't you dare do it. Sweet. We got the Hagia Sophia. We get the free profit. And we can enhance our religion. I'm going to go ahead and grab... I, I like religious art because that's what we're going for. But mosques are just really nice. So I will be grabbing those. Because I pretty much have to. And then... I think I want to get reliquary, reliquary, reliquary. I don't know how to pronounce that word. All right, we get that. We get a lot of extra faith for every person that we expend. And you expend a lot of great people throughout the game. So I'm going with that one. 
I've never picked it before, but it certainly does seem interesting to me. So I'll be going with that. All right, no more wonders because there's a very, very big chance people will uh, screw me over on that one. Although I would love to hang in gardens. That would be so good. Screw it. We'll, we'll try. We'll try. I'm going to go ahead and say that we're probably not going to get it. But not trying that would be lunacy. All right, civil service. We're now buddies with Wellington. They're giving me a bunch of food, which I don't even really want. I want Bucharest. All right, we're going to have to get 500 gold before I bribe them. But we have the time. We're going to do that. We will do that. I have a lot of money. I have a lot of income right now. I want them on my side for their culture bonus. And then also, it would be fun to uh, piss off Austria by doing that. Because they don't like me as it is, I believe. I mean, we're friends and everything, but they have their doubts. Oh, yes, they do. Wait, I just realized. I'm, I think I'm playing without mods right now, but they're still in the game. How does that work? I guess the game must be very confused right now. I hope I didn't ruin anything. I really, really don't hope that. All right, kill him. Oh, God, they're not taking any damage. That is bad. Oh, look at all the food. We must have gotten civil service, which I didn't even realize. But yeah, I guess we did get that. All right, so we'll get education just to get access to the colleges and all that. After that, we're definitely uh, making our way for metal casting, which means construction as well. But, you know, education is quite important, so we'll go with that. Are you kidding me? All right, kill the galley. And this city has grown. Look at that. That's wonderful. So much food. All right. So that we now have two riders in our guild. Uh, which does mean, however, that we are going to need to get um, another amphitheater to store that piece of riding. But we have 19 turns. So I'm not tripping about it. Borders have grown some more. Everything's connected as well. Which is really nice to see. I just need to figure out where I'm going to make a third city. Because going with two cities is completely possible. But it's far from ideal. In my opinion at least. Especially if you want to get lots of tourism. Lots of culture and all that. I do think that getting more cities could be better. So we got to think about making a third one. And I'm think. I'm thinking I'll, I'll probably just put it right here, next to the river, get the silk, get horse, and dyes and all that, because I, I, I would love to get the silk, but I also want to try not to get too close to Austria. Yeah, you got it. I'll do that. All right. So going over there is an idea. We're going to be quite close to Bucharest, but then at the same time, that oh, come on, man. I mean, at least I got free money out of it, but I, you guys screwed me over anyway. I told you it would never work. Alright, so let's see. We, yeah, okay. Let's get our next settler. Because we did get the National College, and that's good. Alright, you guys grew again. My god. You are growing way too fast. So I guess we fixed that little problem we had earlier. No, I'm not giving you that for free. What is wrong with your stinky face? Alright, let's see. All right, so I can give them 500. Do it. Get them on my side as allies, which means I get 12 extra culture a turn. You can't turn that stuff down. I mean, you can turn that stuff down. I guess it is, you know, possible, but I would not recommend it. Oh, people love the king. Why? Did I get that from Bucharest? I did. Totally did. All right. Good stuff. Good stuff. A great artist appears. That would make Bucharest like me even more. Which means I don't have to spend any money anymore. Or we can get cultural centers. You know what? We do have to make the amphitheater. So I think that making this would be a wiser decision at this point in the game. And we'll grab masonry and just work our way to uh, construction and all that. Get to workshops. Because we do need that, that stuff right now. And then we'll just make our third city out here. I think Colossus is good for you. 
We can purchase stuff with faith. Can we get a, uh, what's that called? Monastery. Here we go. We can. You better get that. You better get that. All right. So how much do we get from it? Each source of incense and wine worked by the city produces plus one faith and plus one culture. So that's four faith, four culture from one building. I mean, that's good though, isn't it? That's some good stuff. All right, there you go. We'll kill these losers. Just wipe them out. They're in my way. And I don't like it. All right, well, Austria is still friendly. If they do remain friendly for much, much longer, then I, I guess I don't really have to worry about military things, you know? Glasgow's grown way too fast. They're about to overtake Edinburgh. We can't let that happen. Actually, we can't let that happen, and we will, but... That's a bit strange. But that's what you get when you make a city surrounded by grasslands. Alright, kill him. Get them the hell out. So, two more for the lighthouse. Which is good. Um, Alright, so I guess you're done. Get in the ocean and swim. All right, get some more farms around here. This guy's done. Where do you think I should go? Get all the way over there? Are you kidding me? Why would I do that? That is lunacy. That is crazy. I guess I could sell over here. That's pretty nice, you know. It's quite well balanced. It's not too close to my own city. I think I might just do that. Because this one is very close to Bucharest, and if I do make a city there, it would, you know, really limit the, uh, the possible growth. Alright, get a college, because that, we can actually store a writing in the college. So that's pretty freaking great. Alright, construction is done. Alright, go, go, go. Escape, man, escape. Oh, they are actually suggesting I go there now. Oh, shit. That is bad for me, man. That is quite bad. All right, you know what? We don't have... Get a composite bowman. That settler is probably going to bite the dust right now unless the swordsman wants to stay in there. Which I very much doubt. That guy's, that guy's dead. So we're in trouble. Damn it. All right, get a water mill for production. I mean, at least that would speed it up a bit. Because things are not looking too great. We have buttloads of food, but what we need... Oh, they're alive. Thank God. All right, man. Let's go over there. They can't get you and you're okay. And then the uh, the bowman will follow. All right. Glasgow's grown again. Jesus Christ. These people are crazy. They just keep on growing. It's about to actually outgrow its borders. Like, we're already working every tile we can work right now. What the hell? I don't think I've ever seen that before. That is like some Hanging Gardens level of food. See, they're suggesting I go here. I mean, it's... That was my initial idea. It just worries me a little bit that I'm really limiting the, uh... The possibilities of that city, you know? I don't want to screw it over. Alright, get that construction thing going. Alright, there you go. They're also saying I could go there, but that's not next to a river, is it? Wait, let me just check. They do count it as next to a river. That's good. All right, guess we're going there then. Guess we're going there. Just to get that extra reach. All right, so you... Oh, look, more pearls. Isn't that beautiful? All right, so the rider's almost done. Engineering. Yeah, I don't really know what you're doing out of here. That guy serves pretty much no purpose right now. All right, go over there. It's not the most ideal place for a city uh, because of the, you know, luxuries that are around. But at the same time, like, you got silk, you got dye. Uh, we're, not get, we're not getting those gems, but we do have some sheep, some horses. Uh, we're probably going to get to these dyes as well. So, I mean, it's all right, you know, I'm not complaining. All right, get metal casting. Because we got to get that workshop set up. Also, swordsman. I would love to upgrade this guy. Even though I just realized uh, we have no iron. Alright, they're still growing. Still growing. There's no stopping them. I swear, four turns. They're... Jesus Christ. I'm actually pretty glad I picked that spot. That was really nice. Alright, go. Alright, wipe them out. 
Just settle right here. Here we go. Sterling. Sterling now exists. Alright, so we have a lot of money. Well, we, no, actually we don't. Scratch that. We don't have a lot of money. But I do want to grab some tiles where we can. Because I do want to make sure that we get this silk before Bucharest gets to it. Um, so that's something we're going to try. Yeah, I can't really give them anything. Because I just spent all of my money. Uh, let's see, default, that's fine. Alright, so let's start them off with a shrine. That should do for now. No, get the hell out of here. I don't want any of that. Uh, yeah, keep shooting them, just get rid of them, make, th make this, uh, this world a little safer. There we go. Why are we still stuck on this one shitty island? I've seen everything, it's just me and Austria, so it must be Ireland. There's no other way. Also, I kind of want to do want to attack Austria and murder them because, uh, actually, I haven't checked this all game, but they have the worst army in the game. We're the only two people around, which means if I do take them out, nobody will know. And nobody will give a shit. Isn't that awesome? It's almost the same as war in real life. Nobody knows that you're wiping a country out, or the country you're wiping out, nobody knows it exists. Nobody can do anything about it. You could go up to like a jungle somewhere in South America, find a tribe that nobody knows exists, and you could murder them, and nobody would know. Oh, look at that. Golnage. Golnage, son. Yeah, I'm not trying to inspire anyone, though. They don't go out into South, South America and start murdering tribes in a jungle. That sounds like a bad idea. Don't do that. Uh, Alright. We got that. We got that writing. Alright, kill. So I guess we just got our new idea, which is murder the shit out of uh, my enemy, Austria. It is an idea. I'm just saying. Uh, Inquisitor, missionary. I kind of do want to get a missionary, but at the same time we can get a mosque. Which is also quite good. Mosk it up, man. Mosk it up. Get that. Circus, uh, Colosseum, also quite nice, not gonna lie. A market. There's so many choices, what do I do? Alright, get the National Epic. I was thinking about going with culture earlier. That is still the plan, so if we can try to, uh, increase the rate at which we make great people, because that's what we need. Alright, upgrade for you, my boy. Kill. Alright, my city grew again. And now it's starting to slow down. As opposed to Glasgow, which is not slowing down at all. Oh my god. Plus two science, blah blah blah. Scientist slots. When this great work of writing is filled, increase the length of golden ages by 10%. That's good. One scientist means three points and then also three science. I mean, that's good. That's some awesome stuff. Okay. Although I do think it would benefit more from grabbing... Wait, why did it do that? Alright, stop with this. I need the city to grow, most of all. You know, that's more important to me than it producing stuff or than it making great people. I want it to grow. I want it to not suck. Are we about to see new land? Because I'm not sure my body can handle this. I might go insane. Also, we have a lot of money again, which is cool. Um, alright. Let's start making some farms and stuff around our new city. And we should probably also see if we can connect, um, all three of my cities together. Alright, let's see. You're not working the bison. I'm not really sure why. Probably because it's too far away. One, two, three. It is too far away. What in the... Okay. Uh, just get some farms going, man. That's what it's all about. There we go. Barbs are gone. What's up, Wellington? Look, just let me... Alright, do nothing for one turn. We, we will move in there. I promise you this. Metal casting. Alright, so that's done. Farm it up. You go up there. Let's see what the Austrians are up to. I, I really want to murder them, actually. The more I think about it, the more I want to hurt them. 
Let's see. Okay, we got no really good options there. Steel or physics. Notre Dame, that could be a good idea. That could be a really good idea. All right, let's see if we can get that. And then also, obviously, trebuchets. If we are going to kill Austria, that would be great to have some nice trebuchets. Blast, just blast away Vienna, Salzburg. Just murder them, man. That's what it's all about. All right, culture increased in all cities which have built a world wonder, and the empire immediately enters the Golden Age. We don't really have a lot of world wonders right now, and I would actually do we have a spot for art? We do have a spot for art. Okay, let's start with the artistic genius. Just get that art. Bucharest's happy. That was the idea. I did want to, you know, to get really happy and be like, oh, thanks for doing that. Oh, we got two unemployed citizens. What? That is nuts, man. Are you telling me they have, like, no buildings that actually need specialists? They need to get some of those. They really, really do. All right, you're done. Go ahead and make me some art if you can. If you think you got it in you. Oh, self-portrait. You're just making a selfie. Anybody can do that, man. I, I make selfies all the time. It's not impressive at all. Anyway, guys, I'm going to leave it here for this part. It's already pretty long. Hope you enjoyed. We got the third city, Sterling. We came up with a plan to get more culture, which we're working on right now. And then also we uh, came up with a plan to maybe eventually murder Austria. They have a shitty army, although they did just overtake me. But I have the highest literacy approval population. I'd like to see them stop me. I like to see him do that because I haven't really focused on building an army. And if I do, then it's going to suck for them. So stay tuned for the next part. I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll talk to you.